video we are going to see second pvc basic max fifth chapter partial fraction from this chapter in board examination they will ask one five mark we'll see what is a partial fraction any given rational fraction may be expressed in terms of different simple fraction which are called partial fraction like this simple form if you write this is known as partial fraction if you split this then that is known as resolving into partial fraction the process of splitting a given rational fraction of the form from this to this is called resolving into partial fraction polynomial function an expression of the form a not x power n plus a1 x power n minus 1 plus a2 x power n minus 2 plus a n a not not equal to 0 where a not a1 a2 a n are constant are called polynomial in x of degree n the highest power is the degree example the equation is given what is the highest power in this 2 so degree for this is 2 let us consider the another example. In this, what is the highest power? 7. So, degree is 7 for this. If a constant is given, the degree is 0. All non-zero constants are considered to be a polynomial of degree 0. We will see the definition of rational fraction or rational function. If f of x and g of x are two polynomial in x, then f of x by g of x, where denominator g of x is not equal to 0, is called rational fraction or rational function, like this. A equation by another equation, polynomial equations. This is considered of two types, proper and improper rational fraction. Let us consider a doll. In this, this is the head and this is the body. Head is small, body is bigger than that. So this is known as a proper doll. Likewise, the degree should be less in the numerator than the denominator. Then this is known as proper fraction. A rational fraction f of x by g of x is called a proper rational fraction if the degree of the numerator polynomial is less than the degree of the denominator polynomial like this otherwise if the degree is greater than the denominator or equal to then this is known as improper rational fraction a rational fraction is called an improper rational fraction if the degree of the numerator polynomial is greater than or equal to the denominator degree of the denominator example like this see the what is the degree for this 3 what is the degree here 2 this is greater than this or maybe equal then this is known as improper rational fraction so degree for this is 2 let us consider the another example in this what is the highest power 7 so degree is 7 for this if a constant is given, the degree is 0. All non-zero constants are considered to be a polynomial of degree 0. We will see the definition of rational fraction or rational function. If f of x and g of x are two polynomial in x, then f of x by g of x, where denominator g of x is not equal to 0, is called rational fraction or rational function like this a equation by another equation polynomial equations this is considered of two types proper and improper rational fraction let us consider a doll in this this is the head and this is the body head is small body is bigger than that so this is known as a proper doll likewise the degree should be less in the numerator than the denominator. Then this is known as proper fraction. 
a rational fraction f of x by g of x is called a proper rational fraction if the degree of the numerator polynomial is less than the degree of the denominator polynomial like this otherwise if the degree is greater than the denominator or equal to then this is known as improper rational fraction a rational fraction is called an improper rational fraction if the degree of the numerator polynomial is greater than or equal to the denominator degree of the denominator example like this see the what is the degree for this 3 what is the degree here 2 this is greater than this or maybe equal then this is known as improper rational fraction now let us solve the exercise problem exercise 5.1 express the following as a sum of polynomial and a proper rational fraction first problem x square plus x plus 1 divided by x square minus 1 this is given to us now check whether this is a proper or improper highest power is 2 here also degree is 2 both are same this is an improper fraction if this is an improper fraction what we are supposed to do means first we will divide this write the numerator x square plus x plus 1 denominator x square minus 1 now we want to divide it, divide this write some values here if you multiply this both we should get the same term so we'll put 1 1 into x square is x square multiply 1 throughout if you multiply 1 here 1 into 1 is minus 1 we want to remove this so we'll multiply by minus sign throughout if you multiply by minus sign this will get cancelled x square and x square will get cancelled so x will be a minus into minus is plus 1 plus 1 is 2 now we can write this term as x square plus x plus 1 by x square minus 1 equal to numerator plus x by 2 by x square minus 1 now check whether this is a proper or improper this is a proper fraction because numerator degree is 1 denominator degree is 2 so question is to express the sum as a polynomial and a proper and a ra proper rational fraction so this is equal to a polynomial plus this is a proper rational fraction so in this exercise we are going to solve the problem like this question will be given we will convert this as a sum of polynomial and a proper fraction second question three x square minus four x plus seven divided by x plus seven check whether this is a proper or improper this is improper fraction because degree is two a degree is one improper fraction Now what we have to do, we will divide this. 
3x square minus 4x plus 7. This is x plus 7. Now write some term here. If you multiply with this, we should get this first term. Here x square is there. Here x is there. Here 3x square is there. So we'll multiply by x. x into x is x square. But we want 3, so we'll multiply by 3x. If you multiply with this, 3x square plus 7 3s are 21x. Now, subtract this throughout. If we subtract, this both are same term, will get cancelled. Plus into minus is minus. Minus 21, minus 24. Minus 25x. Now bring this down. This is 7. Now again this is proper because this power is x is 1, degree is 1, here also degree is 1. So we will get the same term. Otherwise we can stop like previous proof. We want to get the same term. So we will put minus 25. Minus 25 into x is minus 25x. Minus into plus is minus 25 into 7 is 175. Now we will take the opposite sign. By subtracting minus into minus is plus this will get cancelled. Minus into minus is plus 175 plus 7 is 182. Therefore, three x square minus four x plus seven by x plus seven equal to three x minus twenty five plus one eighty two divided by x plus seven. This is equal to a polynomial. plus proper fraction. This is the second problem. Now let us solve the third problem. Third problem. x square minus 1 divided by x square plus 1. This is an improper because both the powers are same. A degree is 2, here also degree is 2. This is an improper fraction. So like previous case, we will divide this. x square minus 1, x square plus 1. Put some term, if you multiply, we should get the x square. So we will take 1. 1 into x square is x square. x square minus plus 1. Now take the opposite sign. We can cancel this. Plus into minus is minus. Minus 1 minus 1 is minus 2. Therefore, x square minus 1 by x square plus 1 equal to 1 plus minus 2. Plus into minus is minus divided by x square plus 1. So this is a polynomial and a rational fraction, proper fraction equal to a polynomial plus or minus proper fraction. If you want we can take the minus in here so that it will be plus sign. Question is we want to separate this term. 
fourth problem five x square by x square plus four x plus three this is an improper fraction why it is called improper fraction the degree is two years the degree is two years both are same so this is known as improper fraction now we'll divide this division 5 x square x square plus 4 x plus 3 what is the condition we should put some term if you multiply this both we should get this here x square is there here 5 x square is there so we'll put 5 if you multiply with this 5 x square plus 20 5 4 so 20 plus 5 3 so 15 subtract by minus sign throughout this will get cancel minus 20x minus 15 therefore the question equal to 5 plus minus 20x minus 15 divided by x square plus 4x plus 3 leave it as it is or if you want you can take minus sign common 20x plus 15 because minus sign we took common this is equal to a polynomial plus proper fraction why proper fraction degree is 1 degree is 2 so this is known as a proper fraction now we'll see the fifth problem fifth problem x power 4 by x minus 1 into x square plus 1 this is given to us so to know whether it is a proper or improper we'll expand this first x into x square x cube x into 1 x minus 1 into x square minus x square minus 1 into plus 1 minus 1 group this x power 4 by x cube minus x square plus x minus 1 now the degree is 4 degree is 3 this is an improper fraction this is an improper fraction now we will divide this x power 4 this is x cube minus x square plus x minus 1 put some term here if you multiply we should get this so x cube into x is x power 4 multiply x throughout minus x cube plus x square minus x now multiply throughout by minus sign so this will get cancelled minus into minus is plus plus into minus is minus minus into minus is plus now again the degree may remain same so we'll put some term to get the same x cube 1 into x cube is x cube multiply 1 throughout put minus sign x cube minus x cube will get cancelled minus into minus is plus so this will get cancelled plus into minus is minus this will get cancelled 
minus into minus is plus that is 1 therefore x power 4 by x minus 1 into x square plus 1 equal to x plus 1 plus 1 by x cube minus x square plus x minus 1 or we can write this as a factor because how we got this term by expanding this this is equal to x plus 1 plus 1 by x minus 1 into x square plus 1 now we'll see the sixth problem four x cube minus two x square plus three x plus one divided by two x square plus four x minus one degrees three degrees two this is an improper fraction Now we will divide this. Four x cube minus two x square plus three x plus one. Denominator is two x square plus four x minus one. Now we know that we should get the same term here. So here two is there. We will put two. Two into two is four. Here x square is there. Here x cube is there. So x. 2x into 2x square is 2 to the 4 x cube. Multiply with this 4 to the 8. x into x is x square minus 2x. Multiply by minus sign throughout. This will get cancelled. Plus into minus is minus minus 8 minus 2 minus 10 x square minus into minus is plus 3 plus 2 is 5 x bring this one down now we should get the same term here 2 is there we want to get 10 so minus 5 5 to are 10 x square x square so we will multiply by minus 5 throughout minus 5 into 2 minus 10 x square minus 5 4 so 20 x minus into minus is plus 5 multiply by minus sign throughout now this both terms are same we will get cancel minus into minus is plus so 25 x plus into minus is minus so this is minus Therefore, question 4x cube minus 2x square plus 3x plus 1 divided by 2x plus 4x minus 1 equal to 2x minus 5 plus denominator 25x minus 4 divided by 2x square plus 4x minus 1. Now we will see the seventh problem. 7th problem. 4x square minus 4x minus 1 divided by 2x minus 1. The degree is greater than the denominator therefore this is an improper fraction we'll divide this 4x square minus 4x minus 1 2x minus 1 
I'll put some term. You should get the same term. Four is there, so two two are four. Your x square is there. Your x is there, so two x. If you multiply with this, four x square minus two x. Multiply by minus sign. This will get cancelled. Minus into minus is plus. Minus four plus two. Minus two x. Bring this minus one down. Now to get the same term, we'll put minus one. Minus two x. Minus into minus is plus. Multiply throughout by minus sign. This will get cancelled. Plus into minus is minus. Minus one minus one is minus two. Therefore. 4x square minus 4x minus 1 divided by 2x minus 1 equal to 2x minus 1 plus minus 2 divided by 2x minus 1. Now we'll see the eighth question. x cube plus seven divided by x square minus two x plus one degrees three degrees two. This is an improper fraction. This is an improper fraction. So we'll divide this. X cube plus seven. X square minus two x plus one. Should get the same term. So multiply by x. X into x square is x cube minus two x square. X into x is x square plus x. Multiply by minus sign throughout. This will get cancelled. Your x square is there. Minus into minus is plus two x square. Plus into minus is minus. Bring this seven down. Again, this is improper because degree remains same. Plus two. Why to get the same term? Two x square. Minus four x plus two. Multiply by minus sign throughout. So this will get cancelled. Plus into minus is minus. Minus into minus is plus. Three minus four minus one is three x. Plus into minus is minus. So this is five. The four so we have converted a polynomial and a proper fraction By this problem, we have finished this exercise. Next exercise, we will see in the next video.